Hello everyone, this is ET once again and welcome to my Vlogmas series. So today I'm going to be doing a DIY of a Santa station that you can make um, by yourself. DIY, it's just something that you can make in the little corner of your house. So let's start and stay tuned. Guys, kumusta kayo in the hat? Hello. Okay, so let's get started. Um, so I just wanted to show you guys yung mga nabili ko um, in making this DIY Santa Stop Station. I have a shelf here in this little corner in my kitchen. And this is what we're going to be using. I bought some decors as you can see. Milk and you know, Cookie Company decor. Um, candy Cane Factory Station. Just little something that you can put on the wall. And this is a, a placemat that I got from Target as well. It has that print of candy cane in it and we're going to be using this um like a snow blanket just you know to have that effect na para siyang, um you're on the snow it's already open so you can see the texture so we're going to lay it over here on the um shelving area um as you can see behind me there's already a mattress um and then I got these two containers. They're so cute. This one, you know, you can use different colors if you want. The Santa Workshop. And I like that other green one too. I mean, like what I said, you can use any other colors of containers that you'd like. And then we're going to be using this uh, ribbon. And it has that print of, you know, mint candy cane as well. It's so cute. And I have a mason jar here and candy canes. So we, you need like this much of them or more than that. It's better. And so these are the stuff that we needed. Just very plain and simple. I also got some marshmallows. These are the mini ones. So we're going to be putting it in that little mason jar. So, just make sure you have all the things that you need. So, we're going to be cutting. So, make sure you just cut the paper only. And then, this is what we're going to be putting on the wall. And we're going to be using push pins for that. Just like that. Perfect. Just be careful in doing this. Make sure not to poke yourself. And this is the snow blanket. So we're going to be measuring this. This is what we're going to put on top of the shelf. So this is just the measurement that we needed. So maybe like 3 foot long will be good. So make sure it's extended on the side of the shelf. And these are the two decors that we're going to be putting. So cute, right? There's, they're three dollars um, at Target for each of them. So you just put it just like that, like so. And just make sure you balance it. And these are the candy canes that we got. Make sure you have that much or even more. And we're gonna put it in one of those containers that we got. I just decided to put it on that white container so it matches that decor that says candy cane. And so cute. There you have it. Just fix it. And now we're gonna be putting these mini marshmallows inside that mason jar. So make sure na puna in your yung uh, mason jar. Put as much as you you want. But it's up to you again. You can make it halfway or fill it up. Alright, so now that you filled in that um, mason jar, we're gonna put a ribbon around the neck of the mason jar. If it's kind of hard, if it's sliding off the ribbon, put a rubber band around the mouth of the mason jar. So, just like that. 
so that yung ribbon it will grip on the mouth around the mouth of the mason jar para hindi siya dudulas and then you just make a bow make a ribbon just like that very simple right so now hindi na siya dumudulas you can make it fancy or just a simple bow is fine and there you have it now you're gonna want to fill uh oh sorry and set up eh. there you go gusto ko kasi punong puno yung mason jar and you just um put that little i bought this towel that says mrs claus and I just put it under that mason jar in the middle of the shelving. And then now you're going to be using the other jar to put the hot cocoa powder. So you can put this much or less. It's up to you. I just want to fill the whole container to make it look full. And then you want to fix it like it's, you know, almost coming out of that container just like this. Yan, ganyan lang. Instead of lahat nakalagay sa loob, make sure some of them are sticking out. So it's visible for Santa, diba? And then you just kind of fix it, balance everything out. And then just like that. Yeah, and we're almost done, guys. So cute. So we're gonna use these starry lights. Make sure you put batteries. I put two 8A batteries. And just test it. Just to make sure that everything lights up. Yay. Perfect. So I printed out some hot cocoa sign. And then put tape on it all around the back and just put it on the wall. And these mini marshmallows, I love them. So just scatter, um, just scatter it around the um, shelf on top of that um, towel, the Mrs. Claus. There you go. And you know, guys. So hinihintay ko lang na matapos mabake yung cookies because I intentionally bake some cookies just for this decor. And then, ayan, ang cute, diba? It feels like the elves and Santa's coming. Yeah. Ayan, guys, ang cute with the lights on. And then, the hot cocoa sign adds up to the cuteness of this whole decor. Tsaka, Ikalat ni lang yung marshmallow. It make it seems like you know someone had touched it and try to eat them. So malapit na matapos yung big cookies natin. And then the hot cocoa. So we want to make sure we have a little sign for each of the items that we have on the shelf. Just kind of fix, balance everything. There it is. So cute. Lalo na kapag may mga little ones kayo, or pag may bisita kayong may little ones, they're gonna make it, you know, feel like it's so festive. And it's, you know, the holiday feels is everywhere. So, there you have it, guys. Pag madilim, walang ilaw, mas lalo siyang nag stand out. Pag meron kayong little ones, they're gonna make it feel like it's so festive. And Christmas is just around the corner. Perfect. And another area in my dining area, I transform one of my um, wall decor. I wrapped it with Christmas gift wrapper and I, I hang some decor that says believe in the magic of Christmas and put you know, ornaments that has bells on it and make it look festive once again. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you guys had enjoyed this DIY video. On my next vlog, it will be another opening of the Beauty Advent Calendar 2019. And please watch out for that. Thank you all so much.